Howdy friends, Holly here from Tiny Cotter Silvery, back again with another video for you. Tonight we're going to make a soap using lemon bar from Brambleberry. And I tell you, this is one of my all-time favorite scents. And it holds so well in cold process soap. It's hard to find a scent that holds this well in cold process soap. I'm going to put my, tonight I'm using buttermilk instead of coconut milk. I've got it and I'm going to use it before it goes bad. <laughs> I bought it just for this and I haven't used it yet, so it's time. Before I forget about it anyway. Organic buttermilk. So let's get that incorporated. I've already got my kale and clay in here. solution and for those of you that have never been to this channel before which probably most of you if not all of you haven't been here before I don't use water in my lye solution I use aloe vera juice and I also have a mulberry silk sodium lactate and powdered sugar in here so oh, where's my strainer I was going to strain this Oh, there it is. Just going to bring this to emulsion. everybody's weather doing up here in Washington our weather's just turning it's been so hot the last time I made soap the other day it was almost 100 degrees in here and tonight it's so chilly out that I'm wearing a sweatshirt so how's all your weather holding up I know that California is in flames right now and their weather is nice and hot if anybody's in California, I hope that you're all safe, and I hope that all of your property makes it okay out of this. And that's emulsified. Actually... I'm just going to go ahead and put the, the fragrance. Oh, no, I won't. Never mind. I apologize about that interruption. My battery decided to die right in the middle. Which is funny because I literally just checked it before I started. Now, I don't have a whole lot of this color left. I'm going to try it. If not, I do have some of this fun soap colorant from from uh, Nature's Garden. I don't think this is going to be quite enough, but we'll try it. Oh, I could be wrong. It was perfect.
<laughs> never speak too soon when you're making soap. I'm going to stick blend this just a little bit because I need this to set up as quickly as possible. before and it's very very workable so I'm not really worried about it seizing up or accelerating let's get my mold if I can remember what I did with it oh there it is Pour this all in. I'm going to scrape this container all out because we won't be coming back to this color. tap down and now we'll wait for this to set up I'll be right back with you when this is ready to pour on top of I apologize again I apologize again my camera went off once again I don't know what's going on with that thing and I don't know if I can flood this it was just big of a bucket but I'm definitely going to try down a little bit. Made quite a mess on the end here. I went all the way down. But boy it smells heavenly. <laughs> I wish you guys could smell this. I wish there was smell of vision. My whole little tiny soap studio smells like lemon. It smells wonderful. put on top but I don't know if it's going to do any good it's just a little 
pretty much the same color that's already in there, but... pretty good. Do we want glitter? I don't think we need glitter, but as soon as this sets up a little bit, I am going to put a little bit of a, a, a white mica dust on it. I think that would look nice. It's quite thin still, so it's not a good time to do that. But we will see you back here in 16 to 24 hours for the cut, which is coming up right now. Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome back. It has been about 16 hours since we last spoke and this is ready to be cut so shall we look at and see what we got here <laughs> nothing much to see really it's just plain old lemon bar soap it should all look about the same turned out very good and it smells absolutely amazing. Okay. Just an update for you. Tomorrow evening at 8 p.m. is my August release in my website and if you'd like to purchase anything my website is www.tinycottagesoapery.com I'd love for you to stop by and take a look and if you see anything you like I'd love for you to try out my products and if not that's fine too I'm glad that you're here with me and that's all that matters. Now in my August release I will be having a Naughty Naughty Fountain of Youth and that was the soap that I made with all of the real flowers. Um, we will be having Birchwood Oud. We will be having Galactic Skies. Caribbean Garden, Satsuma yeah. Orange, which is my favorite from this month's release, uh, Peach Pie, uh, Southern Peach Pie, and yeah. Berries and Cream Donuts, and some other goodies in the store as well. I have started doing wax melt and candles. Uh, there won't be many on the release date, but unlike soap, I will re be releasing so uh, candles and wax melts all month long. Okay. So if you don't see anything that you like on the 24th, stop back by every few days and see what's new. Well, thank you so much for stopping by. I hope you'll join me next time. And I hope that you have a wonderful day. Mm -hmm.
Mm -hmm. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye for now.